da li je za Balkan, odnosno za Bosnu i Hercegovinu važno ko će pobjediti, Trump ili Hercegovina? Mm-hmm. I'm going to say a couple of things. One is she, um, she really did develop what you would call foreign policy chops. I'm going to use that term. She went to the Munich Security Conference three years in a row. She spoke at the Munich Security Conference, became friendly with the Germans, and she actually worked with the Germans on the hostage swap, for example. Um, secondly, she... Uh, She's been sitting in the Situation Room with the President and the National Security Team uh, for the past nearly four years. Um, She has a strong commitment to rule of law. And what's best about America, you can see that she's embracing soft power, our values. What, how do our values matter? How do we, How do we leverage our values? How do we take care of our own people? Then how do we take care of our friends? I'm going to say this. I'm not going to put $1,000 down on the gambling table in Vegas. But she offers an opportunity for a reset. She can be educated, and she does learn quickly. And I think, given her value system and how she feels about America, both at home and abroad. Um, she wants to bring, her, bring our best. And if she brings our best to the Balkans, I believe there is a potential reset. Better than Trump, without a doubt. 